This is Naya. She's my girlfriend, and we've been in a long-distance relationship for a year now. <sighs> Had to get Starbucks water because the water on the plane cost money. Today is actually our anniversary, and I'm so, so excited for that. Being in a long-distance relationship, it really makes things kind of hard, especially with the fact that you can't see each other. At least, not very often. And with how little I see her, it makes moments like this so special. And we just try to make the most out of every single meetup. Yeah, it was totally worth it to get this free Starbucks water. She should be arriving any moment now for our anniversary, and I am so excited to have her here. In the grand scheme of first anniversaries, I don't know if this is the best surprise, but I know at least for her, it's gonna mean the world, and that's all I could ask for. Finally here. I spilled my water. This is the same theme park that a year ago we came on our anniversary and this is where we first met up. This is a really big deal for us. This park is really, really special to us. So this film serves a very special purpose. See, I want to give you the most romantic time at SeaWorld. Aww. I want to see if I could even make that possible. I mean, it's a great park. Just it's more centered around thrill attractions and not really having a cute lovey-dovey time. Also, I didn't write you a card for our anniversary so I'm sorry about that consider this film my card to you Naya this is a love story so how we started this special day a year ago was at one of my favorite attractions that's of course Mako this ride holds so many memories for me yes. and I love it so much one second little does she know I have Probably the best surprise for her. She is going to absolutely freak out. The reason this ride is so special to us is because when we first came here, this is where I asked you to become my girlfriend. Let's reenact it, because we're climbing over the drop and I just go, will you be my girlfriend? That's the best. That is the best, I love this ride. This ride is so special and that's that's why I really say this is our ride. Just such a special moment, it's just such a special ride. And it doesn't help that it's an incredible coaster. Oh <laughs> so one year ago we rode Infinity Falls. I would ride it again, I love this ride. But um, this is what the line looks like. This wait is 90 minutes. What? 90 minutes, no way. I'm good. So I want to do Icebreaker because there's something on Icebreaker that you haven't experienced. So this ride is another story and it's almost kind of a curse whenever I, I film new rides with you. I always mess up your first reaction. And so when we first rode this a year ago, the ride operator didn't let me ride with the hand strap. So they made me wear my GoPro on my wrist and the video came out super shaky so we never got to see her first reaction. But here's your first reaction without comfort collars. I hope that didn't come out as shaky as it did a year ago. Even though we are using the same GoPro from a year ago. <laughs> Something's never changed. Yep. Icebreaker without the comfort collars is so good. It's really changed the whole experience for me because it actually used to physically hurt me, but now I could actually like handle it and it's so fun. That ride was so painful before and it's just such a more free, more enjoyable experience without those collars. Want to check out the sharks? Yeah, let's do that. That's fun. <laughs> We're way too big for that thing. I love shark encounters so much. Yeah. 
it's just like such a calm place and especially when it's so hot it's like just it's like a happy place you know it's so perfect to refresh yourself and all the yes. sharks are so cool to look at and it's it's burning hot out here can we like get water or food or yes, something oh my goodness. Right. It's nice being in like a refreshing building outside of the Florida heat. It's so intense out there. But as fun as reliving all those memories was, riding Mako, the shark tunnel, um, trying to get on Infinity Falls, but that line is something else. Dude, and how much fun was Icebreaker with the comfort collars off? Oh my goodness, it's so much better now. <laughs> what, what's crazy is you haven't been here for almost a year. Yeah. And so, there's so much that's changed over that period of time. For sure. Is there anything you want to really do? Pipeline. Dude, so we're finally here at Pipeline and oh my God. tell us how long you've been waiting to ride this. I've been waiting to ride this for so long. Since I first saw them clearing the grounds over here, I've been so excited. Seriously, oh this is going to be so cool. This is Pipeline and we're about to get on. <laughs> Um, we couldn't ride Pipeline because <laughs> there was a thunderstorm. And so we're currently in the middle of a thunderstorm right now and we decided to take refuge at one of my favorite places in this park, this is Stingray Lagoon. It it's just the Stingray Touch Tank. This is one of the most important parts of our relationship. This is a very important place. The Stingrays? I promise you there's a reason. Right here at Stingray Lagoon is where I asked Naya's dad permission to ask Naya to be my girlfriend. That was a mouthful. What's so special about this is what I stated earlier. I didn't want to just ask her at any normal location. Definitely not the Stingray touch tank. I needed to make a lasting memory. And so this is where I chose to ask Nia's dad if I could take her 200 feet onto Orlando's tallest roller coaster. And right there at the edge of the drop where all the anticipation is building, where everyone is, is scared, holding on to their restraint. It's where I turn to my left, and I asked this beautiful girl if she wanted to be my girlfriend. Will you be my girlfriend? <laughs> What'd she say? Now, it's getting late, and I have a really nice surprise for her. wanting to eat here for so long. Check this out, you eat with sharks right behind you. I've never been here. So cool, right? Yeah. I've always seen all of these different fish and marine life walking through the tunnel. But to have them right in front of you as you're eating your dinner, what can be better than that? Oh, and the menu looks great. Oh, I gotta take a look. What I really wanna talk about is, I wanna talk about our story. Aww. A year ago today, I made you my girlfriend, and there's so much story behind that. Three months prior to us coming here to SeaWorld, our page on Instagram was tiny. She was our 199th follower on Instagram. Yeah. <laughs> How'd you even find us? It's kind of funny. Um, I've always been into coaster stuff, so I was following um, one of Zuda Lupa's mutuals actually through Instagram. <laughs> And they reposted a pic, and I'm like, oh, okay. I clicked on it, I scrolled for the page. Surprisingly, I actually clicked out. I almost didn't like, like follow to it. What's so cool is that you followed me, and immediately, when I saw your profile picture, I, <laughs> I went on my personal Instagram account and I followed her because I thought she was cute. <laughs> yeah, what happened was I wasn't even intending to follow or nothing. Just something told me, uh, why not? So I went back, clicked on the page, and I followed. And <laughs> here we are now. Yeah. And so after that, we started chatting for three months. And we decided, let's meet up at SeaWorld. Later, after so many rides on roller coasters, I asked her dad 
at Stingray Lagoon if I could ask her to be my girlfriend right there at the top of Mako. And now we're here a year later and I'm so happy. So happy. I wouldn't have wanted this any other way. Do you want to ride some coasters? Yeah, let's go. Okay. I love you, Nye. I love you too.